Just a normal day in the Roblox community, people are getting banned once again for playing a game. When I say that people are getting banned for playing a game, you probably think that there is something else to it, but I genuinely mean that these people are doing nothing more than pressing play on the game. Yes, for those of you who haven't been living underground for the last couple of months, the Crosswoods games are back on Roblox. Hello there, please make sure to leave a like on this video and subscribe so more people can see this and what is currently going on. And very quickly, please join my Discord server, the invite code, it's Chloe Games and I talk in there basically 24 seven. So the first time we saw this happening and these games are banning people for doing nothing more than simply playing them, like pressing the big green play button, got them banned. That was probably back in like June or July and then reappeared back in October. And now here we are in December they have suddenly appeared once again. So at this point, we are definitely on track for this becoming a monthly thing that happens within the community. Crosswoods is back on Roblox. This probably means the Crosswoods games, but also the Crosswoods hackers that creates these games. I just played this game, pressed spacebar, and I got banned in less than a minute. And then they say a nasty text warning, which after watching this video for myself, I can definitely said that this is probably the worst version of the ban messages that we have received from the Crosswoods games out of all three times that they have now appeared. I'm pretty sure every single time there is a different message that the game makes you type in order to get your account banned. This time, this is absolutely the worst one. Like I'm not even gonna hint at what it could possibly be. That is genuinely how bad it is. So in this video, this person joins a game that on the outside is called Hidden Destiny, but upon actually entering the game, it looks like they don't even try to have it be hidden because the very first thing that appears in this game is at the very top in the biggest letters possible, Crosswoods. Okay, fair enough. There is probably some people out there on Roblox that still don't really know what Crosswoods is or they just aren't aware that this is what these types of games are called. So maybe they would still fall for this. But in this video, this person seems to have a timer in the top right corner, which probably means that they joined this Crosswoods game on purpose in order to time how long it would take to get banned or something along those lines. Basically, the timer started from the very second that they pressed play on the game and then it did the whole crosswords usual thing where it tells you that the game is loading when actually it's not. Eventually, it kind of just disconnects you from the game, kicks you from the game, and that is when people go back to the Roblox website, refresh, and you know, suddenly they are banned, which is exactly what happened with this one. A little bit over a minute, and this person received a disconnected message that said, the same account launched an experience from a different device. Reconnect if you prefer to use this device. They tried pressing leave, on the game. They didn't try reconnecting or anything like that and instantly it took them straight to the ban message, banned for one day. The moderator note was Roblox does not permit inappropriate content in any form on the platform and then like I said, all of the reasons the actual offensive items are the worst possible thing that you could imagine. So if you're still not sure what these games do, basically what happens is when you join them, you press the space bar or you press something on your keyboard and then whilst the game pretends to be loading, that is when I guess you get reported or something like that, Roblox instantly flags it up and then automatically bans you. And that is when the game disconnects you so that you can see you have been banned. Usually the people that create these games are targeting streamers so that you know when they are live streaming they could be like hey can you play my game it, it's a new game you might like it and then they get banned for this whilst they are live on stream the people that created the crosswords game can see their reaction to suddenly getting banned for something that they literally didn't do and especially when it's like that disgusting and offensive so one more time just to make sure everybody is clear right now the one in this video was called hidden destiny there is another one that people are also joining apparently this one is called Yuki and then the third one apparently someone also got invited to one directly in their Roblox messages they said this one is an FNAF game pizza party so like I say every single time this happens just
just be very, very careful with joining games that you either usually don't play or games that aren't on the front page. I mean, just for right now, whilst this is still going on and these Crosswoods games are still out there, just be very, very careful with joining a game that you think you might not be able to trust. And especially if you join a game and instantly it says Crosswoods in big bold letters at the top of the game, big red flags, leave the game immediately, do not touch it. But anyway, I'm going to go over the Crosswoods games being back on Roblox and banning people for playing once again. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.